sandwich with holes? An egg with paint? A table drawer with condensed milk? Or a brooch with pepper? Watch these and other school pranks in our new video. The students see that Miss Smith has left her lunch on the table. They will cope with it quickly. What do we have here? A boiled egg? I suppose Miss Smith likes art. Make holes in a raw egg from two sides. Pour out the contents and leave the empty shell. Cover a hole from one side with hot glue. Fill a syringe with acrylic paint and pour it into the eggshell. Cover the second hole. Hide it using white tape. Excellent! We've got a sandwich here too. Very nice. I wonder what kind of sandwich Miss Smith has today. The answer is simple. A whole sandwich. Prepare a sandwich. Make a square cut in a piece of bread. Remove the middle from cucumber slices. Cut out the middle of the cheese and lettuce leaf the same way. Put the sandwich with holes into a lunchbox. Cover it with a whole piece of bread on top. The teacher comes back to her table. Hmm, she will have her lunch now. Oops! It looks like somebody crunched her sandwich from the inside. Are there rats in the school again? Or do these disobedient students have something to do with it? It's great that she still has at least a boiled egg. She breaks the shell and paint pours out of it. Is it some kind of impressionism art or what? Apparently Van Gogh's hen has laid this egg. Miss Smith has all her fingers covered in paint. Well girls, watch out! Beauty is power especially when you pepper it nicely. Attach an artificial flower to a blank brooch. Sprinkle black pepper in between the petals. I show the peppered brooch to my friend. She sneezes at once and gets mad at me right away. This is not for you, it's for our teacher. Miss Smith sees the brooch and heads in our direction. Yes, of course, take it. She pins it to her jacket straight away. It's so stu- Achoo! Here we go! Now Pepper invaded the teacher's nose and she can't stop sneezing. She can't even make a remark. <laughs> At last, Miss Smith gets rid of the brooch. Question, what will happen if you combine a slinky and a ring binder? The answer is a school prank. Take a ring binder. Take a plastic slinky and cut it to be of the same thickness as the ring binder. Hot glue the slinky inside. Attach the bottom of the slinky to the back side of the binder and the top of the slinky to the front side. Miss Smith has our binder among others. The teacher opens it and goes back to childhood. It looks like a slinky is exactly what Miss Smith needed. It reminds her of primary school. Miss Smith is a sweet tooth and she is also a great prank lover. She has eaten all the candies from a package and now she wants to prank her students. Put radishes into empty chocolate candies packaging. Fasten the cut with double-sided tape and put it into the box. Miss Smith gives the candies to the girls. They love these candies. The girls fight to be the first one to open the package. They are so naive. They think that there are candies inside. But when the blue-eyed girl crunches a radish, all the quarreling stops. Miss Smith has just taken care of the girls' diet. We look forward for our cruel milk prank on Miss Smith to be successful. It's as simple as all the genius things. Pour condensed milk into a plate. Put it into a table drawer. Miss Smith looks for a pencil. It was in a table drawer. She puts her hand inside. Got you! Her entire hand is covered with condensed milk. Oh, the sweet taste of a prank. Victory! Give me a high five or a high elbow. My friend looks for paints. Here, take these. I have new gouache. Put slimes of appropriate colors into empty gouache containers. 
I open a gouache container and take paint with a brush, but I take out some kind of slime instead of gouache. It looks like the paint went bad. It's not paint at all. It's a slime. Take the slimes out of the containers. You can play for the entire class with these colorful slimes. Miss Smith left to talk on the phone. It's high time to use her blackboard for the next prank. While the teacher is away, cover the entire blackboard with refrigerator magnets. Miss Smith comes back. She doesn't like our magnet illustration. Now I will have to clean everything. The blue-eyed girl has brought a radio-controlled car to school. Funny classes will start now. Miss Smith has prepared thoroughly for the classes. She even did her lip makeup, but Miss Smith has only one fan at school. And this is the blackboard. We conduct our car operation as soon as Miss Smith turns away and writes a task on the blackboard. I put her makeup bag on the car. The car takes away her makeup bag when she faces the table. What kind of magic trick is this? Somebody hailed a taxi for my makeup bag. Miss Smith struggles to catch her makeup bag, and the girls are laughing out loud. At last, the makeup bag is saved, and there is no chance of MBC, and the students return their car back to its parking lot near the desk. The blue-eyed girl needs a notebook. Excellent! I've got a spare one. Butter is not only for bread. Spread butter over a notebook sheet. Close the notebook and press it tightly. My friend takes the notebook and starts writing. But something goes wrong. Her hand is covered in grease and a pen doesn't work on oily paper. The blue-eyed girl is outraged. She doesn't like butter at all and especially in her notebook. But I think it's funny. This prank is a success. I will prank my neighbor. I will offer her a special school supplies cup. Take a plastic school supplies cup and turn it over. Heat a utility knife over a candle and cut out the bottom of the cup. Put the school supplies inside. I pretend that I want to copy from my friend. It irritates her a lot, to such an extent that she stands up and takes all of her stuff away. Oops! Her pens and pencils definitely want to stay on this desk. On the other hand, the cup turned into a spyglass. Let's make coffee for our favorite teacher, but we will serve it not in a regular cup. Take a permanent marker and write, drink me, on the side of a cup. Write poison on the inside bottom of the cup and draw a radiation sign. Miss Smith is happy to see the drink. This is so nice of you girls. She enjoys her coffee. But when she finishes it, she notices a warning sign on the bottom. Oops, too late. Miss Smith has a heart attack. Did we actually cause this? Oh dear. Boo! The teacher pranks us in return. Phew! It's great that she's okay. My neighbor always takes my food without asking me first. But I will teach her a lesson today. I will put in very healthy chips for her. Cut a bag of chips carefully near the seal. Take the contents out. Cut carrots into thin slices. And put them into the bag. Fasten it with double-sided tape. Redhead opens a bag of chips. She takes one chip without looking inside and puts it into her mouth. What is it? Carrot? Since when do they make carrot-flavored chips? Or is it my neighbor's prank? The teacher asks to collect notebooks. Excellent! We have a whole pile ready. Make a square cut in a pile of notebooks. Cut out the middle of every notebook gradually. Put one notebook without a cut on the bottom of the pile. Hot glue the notebooks with holes to it. Put stones inside the hole. Hot glue one more notebook without a cut on top of the pile. We hand in our prepared notebooks. The teacher is surprised that they are heavy. 
It's a luggage of knowledge, Miss Smith, but when she takes the notebooks, she understands what's going on. We handed in not only notebooks, but also a few pounds of stones. Did you like our pranks? Then write in your comments how you like to prank your friends in school. And don't forget to give your thumbs up. Subscribe to our channel and click the bell so that you don't miss new school ideas on the Troom Troom channel.